Ramon Abbas, popularly known as Osh Poppy. Osh or Ray Osh Poppy, born October 11, 1982, is a Nigerian influencer and a socialite. He was born and brought up in Lagos State, who is facing criminal charges in the US for conspiracy to launder money obtained from business email compromise fraud and other scams. Welcome to Drop It Media. In today's video, we're going over the life of Osh Poppy. Well, if it's your first time here or you're yet to subscribe, please kindly hit on the red subscribe button and get subscribed to this channel. And don't forget to turn on the bell notification after subscribing. You can also smash that like button to show us support. Without further ado, let us get started. Now, when you hear the theme, Yahoo Boy, the first name that pops in your mind will be the infamous Nigeria internet fraudster. Ray Osh Poppy, who is currently cooling off behind bars in the United States. After a federal bureau of investigation that is FBI charged him for multiple internet fraud cases, the Nigerian internet celebrity came into the spotlight for his luxurious lifestyle, which he cheerfully displays on social media. As expected, his luxurious lifestyle and controversial opinions have earned him many friends and foes. He is regarded as the richest Yahoo boy as of 2020. But even as popular as he is, not many know about Osh Poppy's real name and where he's originally from. So you guys should sit down, fasten your seatbelt while we talk about Ray Osh Poppy. Osh Poppy hails from Western Nigeria. Although the Nigerian um, Instagram celebrity was popularly known as Osh Poppy, his real name is Ramon. Olorunwa Abbas. Only a few know the name because it prefers to go by Rayosh Poppy. Osh, Gucci Master, and Aja Poppy. He got these aliases due to his love for designer products, gambling, and his illegal lifestyle as a Yahoo boy. Osh Poppy was born and brought up in Lagos State, the western region of Nigeria, on 11th of October 1982. Although his state of origin is unknown, he is known to come from the Yoruba tribe of the southwestern part of Nigeria and grew up in the streets of Oworonshoki in Lagos. Details of Rayosh Poppy's education are unavailable. However, following his poor family background, it is assumed he attended a public primary and, a po and possibly a secondary school before leaving to fend for himself. Well, there are claims he had a secondary school education at Government College Ikorodu, Lagos. As far as his religion, raised activities and comments of thanksgiving to God on his Instagram page make people assume he came from a Christian background. On the contrary, the Instagram follows uh, the Instagram star follows the Islamic religion. His name Abbas proves that he is a Muslim and was raised by Muslim parents. So, which religion do you think? Okay, Osh Poppy is from. Is he a Muslim or a Christian? Please let us know in the comment section below. While at that, if you are yet to subscribe, please kindly hit on the red subscribe button and subscribe to this YouTube channel. Don't forget to turn on the bell notification to stay updated each time we drop new videos. And don't forget to give this video a like. What you know about Osh Poppy's parents and siblings? Now, what do you guys know? Please let me know in the comment section below. Osh Poppy may be best at flaunting his luxuries and social lifestyle. But it is not so with his private life. Until his recent arrest by Dubai police, Osh Poppy hardly speaks or shows anything related to his private life, which is why there is only a little information about his parents and siblings. In one of his posts on Instagram, the celebrity said he refrains from displaying any member of his family on social media for security reasons. However, it is said that the social media influencers' parents are alive. It is also assumed that they are enjoying portions of the wealth amassed by their now illustrious son. Also, majority also have the opinion that his parents were suffering while he was enjoying the money. Well, according to Ismail Mustafa, popularly known as Monfa, a Nigerian billionaire and a close friend of Osh Poppy, he revealed that Osh Poppy's father is a taxi driver. Since Monfa's comment on his friend's father's occupation, Osh Poppy has not denied or confirmed such claims. However, the socialite once mentioned his father's second wife in one of his Instagram posts. It appears his father had a second wife who passed away. Ray never gave any explanation of what caused his stepmother's death. 
Mom Fowl also revealed information about Hush Puppy's mother, saying she's alive and sells bread on the streets of Lagos, Nigeria. Ray's mother is believed not to support her son's lavish lifestyle and had warned him severally to stop showing himself off on social media. There are also claims that she questions her son's source of wealth and has refused him to take his younger brother along with him. Yes, Rayosh Poppy does have siblings, and even though he seldom refers to them, they are undeniably a part of him. Ray has an elder sister and a younger brother. He once spoke about his immediate elder sister, saying she died in Bagada, Hospital, Ikeja, Lagos, after awaiting typhoid and malaria treatments. While he is unable to speak further on issues surrounding his sister's death, Hush Puppy claimed the sister died due to failure to pay the hospital's bill of 3-5. He blamed the Nigerian government for the death of his sister and stepmother, saying it was out of their negligence. Aside from his elder sister, Hush Puppy slightly talked about his older siblings. But unfortunately, he did not go further to mention how many they are. However, we know of his younger brother, who goes by the name Yusuf. He's believed to be a Baba in Lagos. Now, life to Hush Puppy has not been that rosy from the beginning. In addition to his many thoughts about his flamboyant nature, Ray also speaks of his very humble beginning that includes his early life experience of struggle and hardship while growing up in the slums of Lagos. Monfa also confirmed it when he revealed that Hush Puppy was so poor that he had debt to settle with him. Many sources reported that Ray once washed cards and was paid 100 naira at the time. Other sources also reported that he once sold second-hand clothes in Lagos. After some time, he left Lagos for Malaysia, where he lived until his arrest. Also confirming his hard situation while growing up in Lagos are his old neighbors who claim that Ray hawked bread to support his family's financial needs and that he only became wealthy after he left Nigeria for Malaysia. However, before relegating to the foreign land, Hush Puppy revealed that he was a heavy gambler. He mentioned unlike casinos as his favorite betting platform back then. Ray left his home country, Nigeria, in search of a better life for himself and his family. Although there are no exact details of what he did to get rich, the socialite revealed that he spent some time in Ethiopia before his journey to Malaysia where he shared uncompleted buildings with Dunkins. He also traveled to Ghana, where he sold phone accessories in the streets of Ashimota. His life began to take shape after landing in Malaysia and then Dubai, where he lived until his arrest. Oshwapi is today one of the richest black African youths. Only a few young celebrities in the African continent could beat Rush Puppy's financial status and flamboyant lifestyle. Well, if you disagree, let me know in the comment section below. And while at that, if you are yet to subscribe, please kindly hit on the red subscribe button and get subscribed to this channel, please. And don't forget to smash this video for a like. Ray has always had a reputation as a Yahoo boy, a local name given to cyber criminals. From his lavish lifestyle of buying expensive cars, bags, shoes, piece of jewelry, and taking expensive vacations. It was evident that he was an internet fraudster and a scammer. However, he claimed to be a real estate developer and has worked hard for his money. Hush Puppy never opens up about his fortune. He once joked about his source of income, stating that he is a professional beggar. However, on his Instagram bio, he states that he is a real estate developer. The new addition came weeks after his friend Monfa was arrested in 2019. To further prove the source of his income, the socialite shared a video of a new real estate investment he started. It was gathered that the real estate investment is located in Kokodi, Abidjan, in Ivory Coast. Hush Puppy flaunts his wealth on social media, and his actions often attract comments from friends and foes alike. He is well known for his fights with other Nigerian celebrities like Fino, Simaya, and others. They all called him a fake billionaire who would be caught one day. In June 2020, Dubai police raided his residence in Dubai and arrested him alongside several of his friends who were with him. Well, the prophecy finally came true. He is currently in jail, facing criminal charges in the United States for conspiracy to launder money gotten from email compromise frauds and other scams. Hush Puppy has been involved with several women, some of whom he dated. 
His latest relationship was with a lady called Amiya Dain. She was Rail's girlfriend for a brief period, after which they went their separate ways. Dismayed by how the young Fredland billionaire dumped her, Dime called him a glorified thief. Oshpapi was rumored to have married a 32-year-old citizen of St. Kitts and Nevis named Shawana Nakesha Chapman in October 2018, thereby earning him the right to be a citizen of St. Kitts and Nevis. However, it is unknown if the rumor is true or false. Information about Rail's children only came public after his arrest in June 2020. During his prayer services, Oshpapi revealed he has three children from three different women. Two of the children live in London, while the third lives in New York City. He further revealed that he had a five-year on and off relationship with the mother of his last child. However, further information regarding the children and their mothers cannot be found. Well, this marks the end of today's video. What do you think about Ray Hush Puppy? Would he be a glorified Yahoo boy or would he be one making or smearing the Nigerian name? Well, I'd like to hear from you in the comment section below and let us know generally what you think about Rioche Puppy. While at that, if you are yet to subscribe, please kindly hit on the red subscribe button and subscribe to this YouTube channel. I really, really, really appreciate that. Take care of yourself. Signing out. Drop it.